hello there. So I have decided in this pour that I want to try another one of my swipes with my small pieces of plastic and my glitter um, medium which is just flow troll and glitter across the center of my colors um, and my colors are going to be viridian green uh, fluoro yellow and a little bit of white um, and I'm putting them down onto a pre-prepared canvas of which I have poured over the drippings that were left over from the last pour and the pour before that. It's not all of them of course but I thought that pattern was quite pretty so rather than mixing them all in together I decided to pour it as it was and that is what the result is. And I'm going to do the swipe over the top of that. Right, so I've put some pieces of paper towel down now in front of me so that I can wipe the plastic swiper off. And I'm going to now put my colours across the middle so that I can swipe them down with my piece of plastic. For the, those of you who haven't seen me do these videos before, I have various pieces of plastic cut out from the cover of a binder which already had the holes um, punched into it. So on some sometimes I use the whole side, sometimes I use the opposite side and I've got various thicknesses for whichever piece of swiping that I want to do. And today I have decided to use a thin piece as I want to do thin swipes down my small canvas. So I'll get started on that now. That was all I wanted to do. That is it. It is finished. I've got my minimal colours, which were just the green, the yellow and the white, with my glitter across. And I will now be interested to see how this dries. I will be leaving this one to dry to see what happens. So I'll just give it a quick torch. I've used no silicone or dimethicone in this picture. And so, of course, I did not expect to get any cells. And I've been very lucky in that I also don't appear to have got many bubbles. So that means I have got a clear 
surface of colour which is very very unusual for me and I think it's so pretty you can see a couple of tiny little dots but otherwise it looks really good so I'm now going to bring it up to the camera for a close look for you in the light and you can probably see the glitter a little better if I can angle it so that you can see the um, glitter particles and when it's dry I will um, add this to the video so that you can see what it looks like in its dried form. That's really, really pretty. I'm very happy with that. Okay, I'm done for the day. That's it. Thank you very much again for joining me and I'll see you next time. Okay, my picture is dried. And I'm so pleased with the way it's dried. The glitter is just gorgeous. I'm not sure how much of that is coming up on camera, but I'm so pleased with it. Uh, the colours stayed beautiful and vibrant. The background colours are unusual on it. And I think it's come out very, very pretty. I'm happy with that.